It's Jessie Lynn Somerville Kane and welcome to my channel. If you're new here, go ahead and click that subscribe button and the bell. And we're just going to get started with today's video. Um, as you can tell by the title, I'm going to be doing a eye look with the ColourPop Rendezvous palette. I saw this on Ulta and I just had to get it. Ugh, those colors are so gorgeous. I'm so excited. I have not swatched them or anything yet. Now, the names are on the front and on the back, so that's pretty cool. We're just going to dip into Style and Grace, which is that shade right there. And we're going to put that in our crease. Well, I'm going to put that in my crease. Okay, I will say that that one had quite a bit of kick up, but I don't mind that. As long as the color performance or the color payoff is worth it. Okay, that brush was a little dense, so I'm going to go in with a little bit of a fluffier one. This color is definitely pigmented, so I don't mind that it had the fallout. And there's been so much going on lately, so I do plan on doing a sit down, get ready with me type video soon. This is a really pretty color. And I'm just putting that in my crease and blending and then gradually just blending the color up a little bit. And there's like a bunch of big trucks and stuff driving by. So if you can hear that, I'm sorry. And I, with this fluffier brush, the kick up is not as bad as it was with that more dense brush. So that's good news. These are blending out like a dream. ColourPop always has amazing, amazing shadows. And if y'all have a quish, question, if y'all have a question about anything else that I have on my face, feel free to ask me in the comments down below. And what are some of y'all's like go-to wintertime like palettes? Like, I know we all have like our bright and fun, vibrant, like summertime palettes and then our like fall type palettes. What are y'all's Christmas winter type palettes that y'all like to use? So I've been doing a lot of like cranberry looks, so I'm trying to stay away from that shade. Oh, I'm trying to stay away. I know that everybody's probably eyeballing that one right there. So we're going to do something with that one today. I'm going to go in with that greenish shade. It's called Release. And I'm going to put that in the outer corner. Oh, that is so pretty. Oh, that's so pretty. Oh, y'all. I'm so glad I ordered this. Like, they had a lot of new palettes on Ulta. And I was like, which one do I want? Which one do I want? And I saw this color, and I just, I had to get this one. I'm going to go back in with a little bit of style and grace and just blend the edges of that. Just going in very lightly. And it's blending out amazing and not like making a mess and getting everywhere. I am completely shook. Now I'm going to go in with my treat, which is that shade right there. And I'm going to use that to highlight my brow bone. Oh, that's pretty. Oh, that's so pretty. Yeah, if y'all want to see me do another look with this palette, comment down below and let me know. Let me know what y'all are thinking about this because... 
This is so pretty. I'm just gonna kind of blend that together. I don't know. I want to go in with my treat on the lid, but then I also want to go in with this like nudish shimmer called Fling. And then two birds. There's just so many beautiful shimmer shades that I just want to use all of them and I can't because then I look crazy. I'm just going to go in with Fling. And I'm going to wet my brush a little bit. Oh, that's pretty, y'all. If you have eyeballed this palette, I highly recommend just go ahead, putting it in the cart, and proceed to the checkout. Because you're going to want this bad boy. Now, I'm going to go in with this Let's Do It like blackish shade. I'm going in very, very lightly with like this little pencil brush. Very lightly on this outer corner just to deepen it up a touch. Like you can barely tell. Okay, it's so pigmented. So you can tell a little bit, but we're just gonna blend. Oh, I just wanted to give it some dimension, you know? And then I'm gonna go in with release. And just put a little bit more right here on that middle part just so it's not taken away from that color all right i'm gonna go in with my treat again and i'm gonna pop some of that in that very inner corner now i'm gonna go in with style and grace and I'm gonna put that on the lower waterline all the way across. Now I am going to finish the rest of my makeup off camera and I will be right back. All right, this is the final look with the rest of my makeup on. Like I said, if you have any questions about anything else that I'm wearing, comment down below and I will love to answer that for you. If y'all have any questions about anything, anything y'all want me to film, let me know. And before you go, make sure you are subscribed to my channel. You can look down below, just click the red subscribe button. And make sure you give this video a thumbs up. No. Make sure you give this video a thumbs up. It means everything to me. And I will see y'all in my next video. Toodles.